for Monster Hunter World Part 10. So pretty much in the last one, we went to the deepest parts of the Rotten Vale, fought the Ordegarin, got its armor, found out about how the Rotten Vale is connected to the Elder Dragons, and we also went to look for the first Wyverness. We got a riddle which required us to kill the Diablos and the Rathalos. We killed the Rathalos and now we're to square one to kill the Diablos. Quite a mouthful and you'd be surprised what you can do in one episode. And it's only gonna get better from on. So let's talk to this lady here and go to our quest. And let's kill the Diablos. Solo, please. Horn Tyrant below the sands. He definitely is a Horn Tyrant. I also got a brand new longsword. Look at this, baby. It's from the Rathian. And oh boy, will it do some damage. I cannot wait to test this out. Okay, here we go. Into the wild spar waste to kill the beast within. We're in. This is absolutely perfect. Stand on top of the food chain, huh? Pretty much. I'll take both of those. See what our handler has to say. Hmm. The fire and horn wyverns, the first wyvern mentioned, must be referring to Rathalos and Diablos. I think it's safe to say that in the forest and in the waste, those two monsters rule with an iron fist or claw. Sure enough, let's get into this and let's see if we can find some tracks. Now, if I would... The last time I saw the Diablos was near the Bareth Sand area, so I'm gonna check there first. We just might find him. Oh, some old footprints of unknown origin. We might have just found our first clue to finding the Diablos. Now, where those footprints continue to, I have no idea. More unknown footprints. Scott Fly's got a lead, and it goes up here. More footprints. Oh yeah, we're getting close. Who's this? Oh, we got a friendly Palico. We'll recruit him, just for the fact that extra help is always needed, especially against giant dragons like these. Okay, they keep going this way. So that's good to know. I might have been right. Bear the footprints as well. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, look at this. There's tons now. Absolutely tons. Ah, cutscene. Scout Fly stopped at this rock. But that is not the Diablos up top. Ah, oh, they're worried about something. They sense it. Up, oh, it's the Bareth again. Look at him prowling. Wow, they really do not like him. Jeez, man. Look at all of them. Look how many there are. And they're all loud, too. Something's happening. Oh, snap! There he is! He just freaking took the Barrett hole. They are gone. Oh, God. You might want to go up. It's the hole, man. It's the hole. We fell down alongside them. Can get buried in that type of sand, you know? Well, there's the Barrett, but where's the Diablos at? That is such a menacing face.
look at that. That roar! Oh my. I need to drink some mega nutrients right now. Uh, some energy drink. The more stamina and more health I have, the better. Ah, uh, it's hard to stuck. Yeah. Perfect. Oh, I forgot. Can't destroy those. Those horns are darn near indestructible. Here we go. That was some good damage. Especially considering that this is a toxin-based longsword. Well, poison-based. So, yep, he's definitely poisoned, all right. Getting some good damage in. Oh, boy! Dang it! I bounced off! Of course he dodged! Ah! At least my spirit blade goes through it! Set some fire traps. Oh, he's going underground. That can't be good. Not good at all. Ow. Oh lord. My health is so low. Jeez, that hitbox range. Holy crap. No, no, I'm stunned. And he's going underground. Recover. Right now. Recover. Okay, he went after my palico. But nobody goes after my palico. Ow. Maybe it's best to stay away from his tail. Okay, I'm gonna have to drink some... Hard shell potions. And a demon drug, just for damage sake. I do not want to get bodied by this guy. Do I have any hard shell potions? I do not. Of course I don't. Of course I bounce off the tail! Look this way, big guy! Yeah, look this way. What's he doing? What the heck? Did he just go to sleep? He just went to sleep! Yo! He just straight up went to sleep! Okay, that's a little random. I don't know why he did that, but I'm not gonna question it. Mega Barrel Bomb for the win! Along with two large... Oh, he's gonna have a terrible awakening. And one small. Yeah! Yeah! Who? Got rid of his horn! Dang it. Probably should did something and sharpened my weapon. That would have been a good idea. Oh, he's tunneling a different direction. Let's go after this big guy. Now, this might not be a good area to fight him in, but I do not care. Oh, he's going underground. That's not good. That's not good at all. That bull charge, though. Yes, right where I need you to be. Uno, dos. Missed the last one. Oh god! Gotta be careful trying to attack him. Look at that. If I get hit by that, I am straight up dead. He's going underground again. Oh. There we go. 
I don't know what we broke, but we broke it. Ooh. Oh boy. Oh God. Oh God. He went in the sand. Jeez, man. Oh God. Two seconds to catch your breath, you feel me? He's going underground yet again. Oh Lord. He charges like a bull would. Dang it! Okay. And he's running again. Don't worry, we'll take great care of you. But first I gotta sharpen my weapon, so if you could look this way, that would be nice. There you go. Must be hard to see with all that sand in your eyes. Also with that flash fly blinding you with some tiny giant... Well, you have, ti you have giant horns and some tiny eyes. Oh god. Giant horns and tiny eyes must make it very difficult to see. You don't really need to see much if you can just charge at everything and kill it. Oh god! That's what happens when you bounce off his tail. Wow. Okay, that's not good. That's not... Figures as much. Charge me three times in a row. I love it. Absolutely love it. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine. You just can't get into it because they would never understand. Okay, we're back and we're ready for action. That was a good hit. Jeez, that roar. Aggressive as always. Come on, come at me. Come at me, I want you to. Or go after my Palico. Oh! See how large that swipe range is? It's insane. Oh god! Damn it! No matter how far I will dodge, I will never be able to avoid that if I'm next to him. Mm-hmm. Oh boy. Come here, look at me. There you go. Didn't see that coming, did ya? Dang it. Ooh-wee. Why? Oh, there he goes again. Underground. Oh! That is such a scary feeling. Oh boy! Thank you, Palico. I really needed that. Ah, I keep bouncing off his tail.
Oh, I thought it was coming directly after me. He's running. Man, he tunnels far in such a short period of time. I tell you what. And he tunneled up. Okay. He has his back front turned. And he's gonna regret it. Oh, jeez. Luis. <laughs> Immediately went for the insane range hitbox. Oh, boy. Yep, I walked right into that one. He's in such a small area here, so I don't think he'll be able to do very many powerful moves. He's poisoned, all right. Oh my god, my health. That is insane. Oh no! He's in such a small area here, so I don't think he'll be able to do very many powerful moves. Okay, round three. This is my last life, so I have to make it count. Look at these gashes, man. Those are some deep gashes. But I have to make this last life count. So I can't mess up, and I must concentrate. Hold on! Of course he goes underground. Ooh. Wait, I got a plan. I got a plan. Oh, Lord. Yes. Okay, I do. I got shock traps. I'm gonna just use one of these on him. And I also have flash pods. Yeah, you didn't expect that. Ooh. Gotta keep it gotta keep it classy, gotta keep it classy and quick. Oh my. That roar. It always gets me. Oh my. Okay. Wow, that didn't even close to affect him. Wow. Time to sharpen your weapon, forget that. Wow, it still did not affect him. There we go, finally. I had to use all three just to get him blinded once. Of course he roars. He's going, he's running again. I really don't feel like I'm winning against him. I don't feel too good about this fight. Feels like an even match in terms of, well, damage goes. I'm scared to get one KO'd with his horn moves. Stuff like that, that will insta-kill me. Oh, he's on his side. Perfect. Perfect. Yes! This is what I've been wanting. Whew, that was some good damage. That was some really good damage. I like that. Oh. Look at the range. That's all I'm saying. Look at the range. 
Oh, we cut another part off. Of what? I have no clue. But it's gone, and he ain't getting it back. Oh. <laughs> These little guys scared me. Oh, man. Oh, my! Okay, I didn't take that much damage. Thank God. He's going underground again. There we go. I got to sharpen my weapon at least. Oh! Buddy old pal, you really scare me. Oh, I broke off his other horn. That's what it was. Here we go. Oh. Oh, he's exhausted. God, no, get up, get up, get up. Lord Almighty, no, 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 run, run, just run. <laughs> oh, that's some scary stuff. There he is. Those poor Castadon don't know what's gonna hit him, and neither does he when I get next to him. Nope, never mind. He knew what he knew exactly what I was going to do, and he went underground. Ooh, careful, careful, careful. Gotta take it easy. Gotta take it easy. There we go. Nice. There we go. That's some good damage. Nice. Blinded again. Ooh. Ooh. Those are the only two flash flies I had. Ah, he ran right into a rock. You will pay for it. Oh no, I need to sharpen my weapon. Go, 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 go. Okay, he's not coming after me. Not yet, anyway. He's limping. That's good. That's really good, actually. He's going to his nest, which is down there. This is too good. This is too good. I just got to keep it nice and civilized, and I'll live. Okay. Okay. Ooh, Nelly. This is it. Go on, place one large. And finally, where is it? One small. Okay. Final frontier, final stage. It's you or me. And I really hope it's you. Oh my! Well, it's safe to assume that I didn't want that to happen. Oh, he's going underground. That's not good.
Please don't tell me he's going in the sand. He's not. Oh, I rolled right into that one. That was not intentional. Wow, he is charging very far. Look how far he went. Now, I could go up there and try to pursue him, or I could just stay back here. Oh, great. Oh. Ah. Yes! On his stomach. This is perfect. Ooh, that was so close. Take it easy, take it easy. Oh no. Far away from that. Yep. Okay, he's exhausted. Who wouldn't be after doing all that? Who we cut off his tail? Ah, oh, you're in pain, buddy. I'm gonna try sharpen my weapon. Oh, nope. Not happening. Not happening. What you gonna swipe me with, the nub? Come on, be real with yourself. Oh, he is in straight pain. He's in distress. Oh god, I need to use the whetstone. Yes. Maximum damage output! Ooh, that was close. Oh my! No, 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 no. Get up, get up, get up, get up, get up, get up, get up. Go, 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 go. Okay, yep, time to run. Yes! Conqueror of the ecosystem. That's me, baby. Now we get to skin ourselves with Diablos and get all the beautiful Diablos parts that it's gonna give us. And we get its tail too. That's a mission successful. We killed this beast! Barely. Cause I was at one life there. I was cutting it real close, but we killed him. Let's get your tail as well. Oh yes. Sweet, sweet loot. The victory, the spoils of battle. We cut off his horns, messed up his tail. It's kind of sad how he had to die, but he died nevertheless. A monster taken down. That's mission complete. Off to talk to the Wyvernist. Look how happy Z is. Ooh, a legend loading screen. That's what I like to call this, even though I have no idea what this even is. It looks, as I've said three times, maybe four, like a prophecy. Or maybe it's a food chain. Maybe that's what it is. I'm not sure. Maybe it just shows something important. I don't know. Whatever it is, I have no clue. Jeez, man, I don't think you're even remotely human. You might be an elder elf, like the guy that we met from the first fleet. Anyway, you you have ascended to the apex and proved yourself. 
Now you may know the secret of the dragon that carries a mountain of fire on its back. The dragon hovers in the brink of death, but the light of life is calling it, drawing it away from its proper grave. It has wandered into the Everstream and lost its way. Now it stands poised and perished there, brimming with fiery life, bringing energy. The Everstream connects every corner of this land like the veins of a beating heart. Should the dragon succumb to death there, its glut of energy will hurtle through those veins, setting them afire and searing the land to ash and scorched earth. This is the dragon's secret. That shall be this land's fate. Nature's course cannot be swayed. Nah, we're gonna sway that course. We cannot let this thing die there. Let's review our current situation. Thanks to the Fifth Fleet's diligent efforts, we've learned a number of things. One, we sure did. Zora Magdaros is heading for the Everstream. Two, that upon its death, it'll release the bioenergy it has stored. And three, that the Everstream is connected to every corner of the new world. Yeah, that's pretty bad. If Zora dies inside the Everstream. Its bioenergy will blast us all to hell. Literally. Commander, the commission should make evacuation its first priority. I'll mm. tell my sister to prepare her airship. There's no time. We don't have any choice but to take down Zora Magdaros. What? Blowing ourselves to oblivion is not what we're trying to do. Correct. And the whole reason we're here is to study the beast's role in the ecosystem. Not erase it from the ecosystem altogether. True. Um, I think I might have an alternative. What, what is that? What if we tried to lure it away from the Everstream somehow? Lure it away? Yes, sir. I did a little digging, and the Everstream borders the ocean, right? Mm -hmm. So if we can lure Zora Magdaros out onto the open water... We can mitigate the blast, and the bioenergy released would start a whole new ecosystem in the ocean. Life would go on. Need I remind you, sir, that we're currently short on supplies from our attempt to capture it. True. And even if we had enough supplies, what kind of weapon could get that thing to change its course? Don't worry. I have a plan. A you always do. Plan. Is that what I think it is? What? Oh, now we're talking. Oh. The giant ship. We could just use this. We can use it as a decoy too. Perfect plan, Commander. Every Perfect plan. Your sweet time getting here, but we're happy you made it. Happy to be here. I brought everything you'll need: ballista, cannon rounds, and a literal boatload of supplies. Not nice. to mention a little surprise. The guild supplied us with one hell of a ship. She's armed with the latest anti-elder dragon weapon. A Dragonator. Excellent. Ooh. Just the weapon we need to drive Zora Magdaros out to sea. Hunters, it's time. Complete your preparations with speed and make your way to the Everstream. I'll explain the details on site. We can do this. We must do this. We have the to do this. Star, light our way. Now, get moving. Got it. Mission priority set. It's time to see Zora Magdaros off. All of us. It's either him or us. If we fail, well, we can kiss the new world goodbye, along with all of our little lives and our little home and everything that we so care for. But if we succeed, we'll have a whole new part of the new world. Oh, the commander wants to speak to us. <laughs> Now that I think about it, it wasn't until the fifth got here that our research started moving forward. I was hoping you'd be the kick in the rear end the commission needed to make progress, but you're more than that. You're a damn force of nature is what you are. I'll just go ahead and pat myself on the back for being smart enough to bring this you here. Me. Well, time is running out. You need to get to Everstream. We'll run through what needs to be done on hey, site. Sapphire Good luck. Star, light your way. Yours, mine, and the guild's. I really hope it does. Look at this place. There's cannons and stuff everywhere. We're really about to go to war with this thing. But first, I need to speak to my handler to even get this started. Okay. Moment of truth. Time to talk to our handler and get on with this. 
Before I left for the new world, I told my father and grandfather, I'm going to write the book on new world cuisine. I'm going to track down and catalog every fruit, nut, and spice there is. Of course, that got a laugh. They nodded and said, go on and figure out that whole Elder Crossing thing too. Hey partner! So when do I get to hear the exciting story of why you're here? Come on there partner, I'm dying to know. Seriously, what is it? Fame, fortune, the glory of the hunt, pirates, assassins, someone special. Uh, I know food. It's food, right? I know now it's not the time, but one of these days we're going to sit down to a big meal and stiff drink and you're going to spill the beans. We're on the hunt! Alright, are you ready to put some swim trunks on this Elder Dragon or what? Well, our ballists die and cannons were more annoying to Zora Magdros than effective. Almost like a noisy swarm of bugs. But the commander says that's exactly what we need. No one wants to deal with a noisy swarm of anything. I'm pretty sure that goes for a giant walking volcano monster as well. All we need to do is present a nice, peaceful, stress-free path for Zora to choose over the noisy swarmy one. Nothing can stop us. It'll take all of us, but we can do it. We'll be the biggest, most annoying nuisance that Lava Fondue monster has ever come across. Let's get into it! It's time to finish this. We're doing this solo all the way. A colossal task. It really is a colossal task. It's a Godzilla type of task. A gargantuan kaiju sort of type of task, you know? Let's get into it! Let's do it! Zora Magdros, here we come! Ah, this is a nice looking cave. Lava imbued and everything. Welp, dead end. Alright. Let's go over the operation. The subterranean channel Zora Magdros is using continue deep underground. We'll have one shot to divert it here when it surfaces. Oh, it's underground. I forgot it does that. If we let it slip by, it's out of our reach forever. That's why I'm breaking out the big guns. Let's see the big guns. Oh, wait a minute. The ship is a big gun. That's what the Dragonator is. Look at the size of that thing! This is the Dragonator. We'll use it to drive Zora back and divert it out into the open sea. You're gonna use it to kill it, that's what you're gonna do. The target will be coming at us full tilt. So your job is to wear it down and try to keep it in check. Be relentless. Are we clear here? Right. Crystal. One more thing. Nergigante is bound to show up to try to make a mess of this. True. If it gets in our way, it's up to you to stop it. This whole operation rides on how well you do that. We can do this. Scout ahead. <clears throat> Signal us if you spot any trouble. The OG himself. And there's the squad leader. Move out! Yes, Use everything at your disposal. I want eyes everywhere. Fight hard and stay smart. It's happening, everybody. Look at him. Stalactites. We've rid the stalactites with gunpowder. Use your slinger to blast them loose. What's stalactite? Look at this, guys. Watch out for those ones. Yo, look at the size of this. Oh my. Jeez. The success of the whole operation comes down to how much we manage to weaken the Turk. Oh man. Up, oh, there's the core. Magma core located. Oh lord. Wow. 
There we go. Jeez. I forgot it spits out lava every now and then. Come on. It's just one magma core. How many hits can it take? There we go. Oh man. What's going on? Oh, that's not good. Ah. Okay. Another core. If I remember correctly, there was a core right at the top that goes right down. Ow. Watch yourself. Excellent. Now it's time to restrain it. Hunters, hold your position. Are the binders ready? Good to go, old man. Okay. Let's make our way to the top. We have to go to the main core in the middle. The one I saw last time. If it's still there, I'm sure it might be. We'll be able to do tons of damage. We're almost at the top now. Gotta be careful not to get hit by those erupting magma cores. Well, these aren't magma cores, just magma. That's good. That's very good. We're almost there. Come on. Where is he? Of course it is. Hunters, prepare to intercept. Nergigante, up there on the shell. There he is. He looks mad too. Let's get him. Charging it up. Oh, he's not gonna know what hits him. He is not gonna know what hit him when we're done with him. Oh man. That was close. Oh my goodness, that wind. Yeah, come at me, bro. Oh man, this is round two, and this is payback for last time, just because our fight was a little cut short. Oh, what's, where's he going? Oh, crap. Looks like Nergigante flew up, he knew he was changing. I still wonder how they're connected though. Ooh, we got it mounted. This is good. Yes, stabby, stab, stab. Round two is in full swing. Oh, that was close. Oh God. Ah, dang it. That tail swipe. Oh. We were doing some damage. And he's getting hit by Zora. Um, Zora's like random meteors. Nergagante, you are about to get the beating of your life. Oh my. Mega potion. Oh, I don't have a lot. Get out the way. Go! Let me get these Zora parts. Has oh yeah. Good. You better fly Your away, bitch. Oh god. What's happening? What's going on? Ow.
Of course it is. Let's get up here. Let's get up here. Ooh. Some ore. I'll take all of that. Oh, man. We are up high. That's the biggest core I've seen. Oh, we're going to keep weakening it, all right. Look at the size of this core. It's bigger than the others. This must be the main one. If we destroy this, we'll probably do a ton of damage to him. Oh, God. Wait, traveling via Windrape? What's going on? Oh, we're back here. Over here. We position the cannons in Ballista. It's time to take it out. Hold nothing back. Okay. We need to find the Dragonator our ship's on. Here we go. Load in the cannon. Oh, he's getting real close. Okay, here we are. Oh wait, Z's already loaded this one. Thank you, my dear Palico, you just probably saved us. There we go. Me and my Palico are doing it. We're the dream team right now. Here we go. That should be five. Oh, it is indefinite pain. You saw all that damage? He's getting too close for comfort for me. There we go. That's another five. That is doing some good stuff. Look at his head. He's in pain. Or morbid pain. Look at the size of his mouth. This man could straight up eat us if he wanted to. He could just maul us. There we go. Nice. Time to use a ballista because that is not going to work. And a one-shot binder too. We got tied down. All right. We have some pretty good defense going, but it could be better. Here we go. We need to load this cannon right here. Oh boy. Shoot, fire! There we go, that's some good damage. Barrier's taking damage. I know! And I'm really trying here. Hopefully we can repel this thing just long enough for that Dragonator to get ready. There we go. Fire! Nice. He's starting to reel back. He's starting to reconsider if this is a good way. Um, that's a lot of lava coming from his mouth right there. Oh my goodness. I'm lucky he didn't spit that over here because we would be, well, we'd pretty much be dead. There we go, I'm firing. That roar is so aggressive. That isn't good. That is not good at all. He just took a huge chunk of our bridge. Please tell me there's some way to stop that attack. 
Uh, I really hope so. We're doing a lot of damage, but definitely not enough. Here we go. Ready when you are. Ooh! That doesn't look like it's piercing too well. It's in some pain. Hopefully enough. It looks like it's changing direction. Just what we wanted. Freaking flawless, man. He's gone. It's over. Yes. It only took forty years. Forty years. That's an insane amount of time. <sighs> nice. Grandfather? Good old Gramps. So, ready to go home? <laughs> yes! Who's that? Hmm. <laughs> Who's that? Nice. We got so much rewards from that. Zora Magdros parts, I really want to know what that makes. Death begets life. But the story is not over. Hey, where are you? Just spawning in, you know? Speak to the handler to depart on an expedition. Wow. But, um, I am think I have to end this part off here. Hope you guys enjoyed it. In the next one, we will see what waits us in more after we speak to our handler. But, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Smack that like button if you did. And I'll see you guys in the next one. As always, 